Hey guys, this is Ricardo back on the Watch With Us channel. And this week we have in for review a limited edition watch from the brand Oris. Uh, for those who have been paying attention to our Instagram page, you pretty much know what's inside the box. Um, it's a watch Oris released on September 9th, and it's the Roberto Clemente limited edition. Now, I wanted to get an opportunity to show you guys the full packaging for the watch. Um, for those who aren't familiar, Roberto Clemente was an MLB player um, of Puerto Rican descent. Uh, he was a great humanitarian within the league, and he actually passed away um, trying to provide some humanitarian aid in a plane crash. So what... Oris did is they partnered with the Roberto Clemente Foundation and they created this limited edition of 3,000 watches. And one cool thing about the limited edition is they presented a watch to each individual who won um, the Roberto Clemente Award that they have in the MLB. And the limited edition number on that watch corresponds to the year that they won the award. But let's go ahead and let's open up the box so you guys could see how the watch is presented. That's the outer box. Then you have the inner box. Here you have Roberto Clemente limited edition. This is the book has some pictures and it has the number of the watch in there as well. We're gonna put that off to the side. And here you see Roberto Clemente's number. He wore number 21, played for the Pirates. That's why you're seeing this slightly off-white color with the black and the gold. So we're gonna remove this inner box, which contains the watch. Here in the rest of the box, you have, of course, the manual and the booklet for the watch. But you know what? We're going to put these aside. And we're going to go straight to the pièce de résistance, which is the main box. I'm going to remove that. And here we have the main box. If you open up that box, and just so you guys know, this is exactly how the watch is presented um, when you actually purchase the watch. So this will be the special edition packaging that you'll get when you purchase the watch. And here we go. Put that up there. And this is the limited edition. Now the watch comes with a spring bar tool. Of course, the watch itself you get the option of this nice brown leather strap here or this NATO strap here. And there is the watch. So now that we've taken a look at the packaging, let's dive into the specs for this great limited edition. Now, the Roberto Clemente Limited Edition is modeled after Oris's big crown family of watches. So the dimensions on this watch are going to be very familiar for those of you who are familiar with that family. Now, you're going to have this case, which is going to be 40 millimeters from left to right. You'll have a 48 millimeter lug to lug. Thickness comes in at about 12 millimeters thick. The case has brushing on the lugs, polish on that knurled bezel that we're familiar with when it comes to the big crown family, and polish on the sides. Now, if we take this NATO off, I'll get to show you the case back on this watch. Here you have 
this beautiful engraving of Roberto Clemente. Clearly says Roberto Clemente limited edition. And right there at the bottom, you see that it's number 2983 of 3000. You also get your water resistance, which is five bars. But nice feature is you also get a screw down crown. So this five bars is definitely different than some of the other five bars that we've dealt with in the past. Your lugs on this are 20 millimeters, which is perfect. Nice standard size. Let's close this up. Here on the NATO, you'll see Oris right there on the keeper. Cool thing here is you actually have a sliding keeper here. So it should fit perfectly on the wrist. And you also have Oris right here on the buckle. Now going back to the front of the watch, you have AR coating on the underside of the slightly domed sapphire crystal. You have a pointer date hand right there, as well as your hour, minute, and a, that running seconds hand. Around the edges of the dial, of course, you'll see the numbers corresponding to the date but what you'll see as well is if you look closely at number 21 here, you'll see that it's actually in a gold color compared to the other black dates. And that's representing, of course, Roberto Clemente's number 21 for his jersey. Now inside you have the Oris Caliber 754 movement. That movement is based on a Salita SW200. So you're getting 38 hours of power reserve and the movement is running at 28,800 beats per hour. The dial, which I find very reminiscent of, of a baseball, kind of that off-white color. And it's actually reminiscent, of course, of the Pirates jersey. So that's why you have the gold on the dial as well as the black and that off-white color. I'm gonna go ahead here and unscrew the crown. And first, of course, setting gets you into winding the watch. Gloves a little loose here. Give me a moment. First setting gets you a winding. Next setting, you actually get to move the date wheel. And finally, when you pull it all the way out, you're able to move the time. Close it in. Screw it all the way back down. And there she goes. Now that covers the specs for this wonderful watch. So now we'll go ahead and we'll jump into the pricing and my thoughts on this limited edition. Now, I've had the Roberto Clemente limited edition big crown point of date for about two weeks. And if you've been paying attention to the Instagram channel, you know what my opinion on this is. I think this is, for me, clearly Oris's greatest limited edition. Um, everything just works on this watch. Um, the incorporation of the theme, um, the pirate's colors, that gold, 21 for Roberto Clemente. Um, the fact that it's a pointer date, so you have this nice, clean, symmetrical dial with no date window just kind of messing things up. 
right? They give you two straps, this beautiful NATO and that leather strap we mentioned earlier. It has 50 meters of water resistance, but you get a nice screw down crown. The loom on this is really nice. You kind of see it there. It's on the cathedral hands and you have some loom pips around circling the dial. It, I mean, I, a point, a part of me wanted to say, oh, you know what? It doesn't come on a bracelet, but that's easy. There's an Oris big crown point of date bracelet out there. You just pick it up and it completes the package. This to me is a great limited edition. The watch, the sizing on this is perfect. And you know what? Let me toss this on my seven and a half inch wrist. So you guys see exactly what it looks like. There you go. And the sizing, that 40 millimeter siding, the <laughs> siding, that 40 millimeter sizing is perfect. Like, look at this. And in that 48 millimeter lug to lug, you don't see the lugs overhanging on the bottom and top of my wrist. So it just sits perfectly. And at under 12 millimeters thick, it, it's not towering, it's not tall. I mean, it's overall, it's just a great watch. I, I, I stick to what I was saying. I think this is Oris's best limited edition. And it's a great limited edition for a great man, a humanitarian for baseball and for his community. Yeah, it is just a great watch. I know we're so used to YouTubers just like coming up with something negative just to seem unbiased. But honestly, I, I can't think of anything negative about this watch. I just think it's a great watch. With that being said, guys, final piece of information is if you're interested in picking up this watch, price of admission for the Roberto Clemente limited edition is $1,950 USD. I think for a 3000 piece limited edition, nice numbered limited edition, um, I, that's right around the limited edition ballpark for Oris. So if you're interested, that's where you're going to have to come in. But with that being said, I want to thank you guys for tuning in for today's review. If you have purchased this watch, you have any comments, any thoughts on your experiences with the watch, please leave them in the comment section below. If you're thinking about purchasing this watch, ask any questions in the comment section as well. I'll have this for a few more days before I send it back off to Oris. Um, I could take some more pictures if you guys are interested, but that completes our review today. And I hope you guys enjoyed the review. I'll see you guys soon.